the first recipient of the Engineering Medal for Research and Development is Dr. Jan Andersek. I sort of very naively, as, as, as part of my graduate work, had the great vision of trying to come up with some better device that's going to allow people to, to walk. I was really at the time sort of fascinated by how the body worked and sort of challenged by the idea, can we make essentially machines that uh, will uh, re potentially replace or replicate what the body is doing. And so this challenge started as part of my graduate work and it's still sort of ongoing, you could say. In terms of our research in prosthetics, it's, it's quite varied. Um, I mean, the ultimate goal for us and sort of the approach is in, in trying to better understand how people get around with their uh, prosthesis, with their orthoses. And from that, uh, we bring that knowledge to try to design better, more functional prosthetic and orthotic devices. Our approach is to try to develop really functional devices that actually have a strong market as well in developed countries. So there's a definite need for high function, robust devices in high income countries, but it's also those same traits are needed in low income countries plus affordability. What I think makes this work unique is, um, is, is partially our approach. It's, it's really data driven in terms of how we approach the design process. It's also very iterative and uh, so there's sort of data that we collect from sort of the biomechanical side initially to help drive the design. But we also, in terms of the deployment of the technology once it's developed, um, go out and conduct clinical trials to really make sure that the deployment is evidence-based, that, that the device is actually making a positive difference for the, for the people who are using it. Once in a while, our legworks team will send me some video of somebody who, for example, wasn't able to walk or do something and they're a fitting success. So those are really sort of the boosts that I get sitting in front of my desk here. I guess in our work, we're fortunate that some of the technologies have actually translated to products. And so these products uh, are starting to have an impact in the community. But more generally, I think we've been able to, through our work, bring aboard other partners who have the same interests. And so there's a little bit of a movement, I think, within the industry where there maybe wasn't before um, sort of this alliance to try to try to make a bit of a dent in, the, in this global need for affordable prosthesis. I feel like I haven't yet sort of accomplished what I need to accomplish. Um, I think we're making good progress, but there's a long way to go. And really, it's just trying to make this, scaling this, this, this venture to a level where it really starts to make a difference around the world. To recognize his groundbreaking and innovative achievements, engineer Jan Andersek is being honored with the Engineering Medal in the Research and Development category.